Good morning. How's everybody doing? What a beautiful day we have today. Can you guys tell how happy summer makes me? It's sunny weather, driving in my car. Don't take much to make a Swedish man happy. Today, however, we uh, gotta address this uh, spoiler that I have on the car. So we're going back out to Auto Illusions in Moon Township. But before we do that, and this is uh, very off topic of uh, today's video, but as you might be able to tell, I don't have my sunglasses that everyone comments on all the time and asks me where I bought them and what brand they are and all that crap. I've misplaced them somewhere, so I have no idea where they are, and uh, I'm a light sensitive uh, blonde Swedish man, so that's why I'm always like this in the videos if I don't wear sunglasses when it's sunny outside. So I'm gonna go pick up some new sunglasses and then uh, we're going to move. All right, so no sunglasses yet. Uh, I walked around looking at a bunch of stores, uh, Sunglass Hut and all these places, and I uh, can't find any ones I like, and I'm not spending $200 on a pair of Ray-Bans. So, uh, she's in it is whenever it's sunny outside. Anyhow, never mind about that. We're on our way to Auto Illusions right now, and when we get there, I need to get out of the car and everything. I'll explain why the spoiler has to come off. So here we are again at Auto Illusions. Let's go outside and talk about this wing here. All right, so hopefully you guys can hear me despite the uh, wind noise here, but I noticed the other day that on one side, see on this, on the right side, the passenger side, everything's fine. But here on my driver's side, the tape was loosening up, so. I'm gonna get in the car because I think it might be better audio. I can't have, uh, you know, the wing coming off and it's not like it's flapping and really coming off, but the tape isn't really gripping. So I called Auto Illusions. They got a better 3M tape that they're gonna apply the wing with. So it actually fits on my <laughs> trunk. This can happen sometimes with aftermarket parts that, you know, they, they don't fit 100% as well as the OEM. Uh, wing did But it's all good. The wings not coming off completely uh, I'm not switching and taking back the original one. I just want it to sit on there like it's supposed to so We're gonna go in here and uh, talk to Tim and we'll get the situation handled Now I know the car doesn't look very dirty on video, but tons of bug stains and all kinds of stuff but This is the number one Pain with having this car the brake dust is horrific I just feel like I want to clean the wheels constantly but after this is taken care of I'm gonna clean the car up a lot of you guys have been asking for a car wash video I've been trying to keep that kind of low because I did about four and a half million of those earlier but you guys want to know how I wash this car so that video will be coming up uh, in a little while don't know exactly when but I probably won't do it today in this video but It'll be coming up. All right, so we ripped off the wing. Here she is wingless. It's so ugly. But it was really thin tape underneath the wing, so we're gonna put some real stuff on there so it really sits. If you keep that end up off the car.
back home. Still no sunglasses, but wing is solid. Got some better 3M tape on there, and now it sits like it should. I guess I have to apologize to you haters who thought that I was taking it off, you guys who don't like it, but I do love this wing. Let's go inside, it's hot out here. Little Red Bull next to the giant water bottle. Now, there will be another modification coming to the AMG C63S, but I gotta go get a money order so I can pay for it first and uh, send it off. It might take a few weeks, but a lot of people have been asking me if I'm going to do this, and I am. Humid, muggy. There's the Fusion, by the way. A lot of people have been asking me if I still drive this car, and I do every now and then. I actually got into it the other day here, and it is amazing the difference in comfort between these two cars. That car, obviously a performance car. When I get into this car, I mean, seriously, it feels like I'm stepping into an S-Class because the seats are so comfortable. Even when that car's in comfort mode, the suspension is still very, very stiff. This car, I mean, it's, it's just night and day. I, I still love this Fusion. It's just very, very comfortable. I, I love it. <laughs> oh my, are you serious? I looked in this car for my sunglasses. I looked here, here, and they're up here. Well, 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 this is fantastic news. Thank God I didn't spend freaking 200 bucks on a stupid pair of Ray-Bans. My glasses are back, like anyone cares. I do though. Man, that's awesome. So, I forgot one thing actually. Place you guys really carefully on the roof here. I actually also went to my P.O. box. So we have a letter that we're going to open. Back into the air conditioning. So before we end this video, we'll do a good old uh, mail reading here. What's up, buddy? What up, dude? Are you sleeping? All right. Set you guys down right there. All right, so there's a letter. Okay. What's up, Autoblog Michael? Found your channel when researching reviews <coughs> on Ford Escapes a while back. Always on Fords. I found your reviews fascinating and very honest. I commend you on your knowledge and understanding of vehicles. I also enjoy your off-the-wall videos on how far you can drive after Sail Master Empty Comes and all of the other What If videos. I recently subscribed to your channel and look forward to more of your videos. The AMG Beast C63S is a thing of beauty and awesome. I'm looking forward to all of her videos. And close is a little gift. Ah. That I hope you can find some uses for. See you at your channel. Sincerely, Callaway0719. P.S. The wing looks awesome. Thank you. I know the wing looks awesome. Ah, ah. All right, let's see what this is here. Ooh. 
what? That's a Mercedes lanyard. That is awesome. Oh, dude, this is dope. I really like this. And an AMG lanyard. Man, this is sick. Thank you, uh, Callaway0719. This is really, really nice. I like this. Cool. I want to wear this during the uh, Pittsburgh Grand Prix uh, weekend. Whoops. All right, so one last thing before we end the video here. I noticed yesterday, and I put up a post on Instagram regarding this, one of my videos just hit 10 million views. I mean, to me, that is just absolutely mind-boggling. I can't wrap myself around that number. I mean, that's a lot of eyeballs. So I just wanted to give you guys a big, big thank you for all your support uh, always. You know, whether you subscribe to my channel before What Happens If videos or after, I really appreciate you being here and watching my videos and everything. Uh, it means a lot to me. Uh, you know, 10 million views, uh, that's just crazy. I mean, before that video, I hadn't had a video, I had had one video over 300,000. That video got 5 million views in a week. And now it's six months later, it's got 10 million. So that, it's just absolutely crazy. How, how big that video turned out being. I mean, it was just something that I was curious of. I made a video uh, about it and apparently a lot of other people were curious about that one thing, what happens if you push the button while driving done some other what happens if videos after that that also got several million views but nothing uh, that came close to that one there so that that is pretty amazing so a big big thank you to all you guys and if you're stopping by the channel for the first time through this video and you haven't already please subscribe remember to follow me on Instagram if you want to stay up to date on what will be happening on the channel before I actually post it on the channel. Instagram is where I'm the most active on social media. Until next time, guys. Bye.